Coastal Enterprises Incorporated has been tapped by the USDA to assist potential low to moderate income home buyers with rural development loan applications. Tom talked with CEI's Director of Housing Resources, Laura Buxbaum, and Housing Counselor, Linda LaJoy, about how the program can help navigate the red tape of government's application process. Laura, Linda, thank you for joining us. It's uh, great to be here to talk about CEI in particular, a uh, new initiative to get people into rural development program for uh, buying their first home. But uh, to start off with, could you talk a little bit about what CEI does for people in, with housing issues? Sure. Um, we provide a lot of different kinds of housing services. We actually uh, develop affordable rental housing and other, uh, other affordable housing. Uh, but the counseling department, which is where uh, Linda and I work, um, provides counseling to people who are facing foreclosure, uh, to, for people who are trying to, to buy um, a home for the first time, uh, or sometimes not even for the first time. We provide first time home buyer education, and we um, now have a new relationship with uh, uh, the federal government, USDA Rural Development, uh, to help people get into um, a home, people of low and moderate income buy uh, a home. And um, that's what we're really here to talk about today. We're pretty excited about that program. And what's that, what's that program like, the program uh, that rural development does to help first time home buyers? It's a fantastic program. Um, and as Laura mentioned, it doesn't necessarily have to be a first time home buyer. Um, if someone whose uh, housing right now is inadequate, maybe too small or too big for their family. Um, but it really, it, it helps the low to moderate income families by subsidizing the income according to the income and family size, um, and it goes by county, these income guidelines. Subsidizing the interest? Subsidizing <laughs> the interest, yes, yes. thank you. You're <laughs> So it can really make that payment affordable to, to families um, getting into a home. It also ensures that the home is safe and secure and sanitary by, I mean, they've got some pretty good um, inspection processes that go along. So the, the, in, the, the interest rate for this program, because it's subsidized by the federal government, can be as low as 1%, and the uh, term can be for as long as 38 years. So that can it, 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 that that is that depends on the family income and household size, but that can, as Linda said, make a, a housing payment really affordable for someone who may have thought in the past that they couldn't afford that. One of the things that we want to make sure um, is that people don't get in over their heads and that uh, they don't uh, that they understand the responsibilities and expenses of buying a home. So part of what we can offer also is some budget counseling and making sure that um, people are, are thinking uh, clearly about the home that they want to buy uh, and, and how much they can afford and what those monthly costs are going to be like. When we first met, I was mentioning that I had been through a similar program uh, under a different name, but it's the same sort of program to buy our home. Um, but it was a fairly complicated process. You give help with that, don't you? Yes, yeah, the application process can still be a little cumbersome, but um, we're there to help you out with that, making sure that you get all the documents in order and, and get them filled out, the application filled out correctly and get it to RD and do rural you, development. Do you find that a lot of people are who come to you who have housing needs are unaware of this program and need to be educated? Yeah. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah. definitely. We, we also provide first-time home buyer uh, classes, um, and uh, that's so something that we talk about in the classes. And I think I think many many people are not aware of the program. Yeah, uh, have you had a good response so far yet to, to this partnership that you've had with RD? It's a brand new partnership. That's, yeah. pr that's why we're here. We want people yeah. to know that we're doing it. So yeah, we, I've, I've dealt with a couple clients right now. We're working on on some things and getting some things together. But yeah, it, like Laura said, it's very new. So. We haven't had that first success story yet, but we're hoping to very soon. The program is not new, as you know. Um, so, and 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 uh, you know, we should say that people that are interested can go directly to to the USDA Rural Development offices if they want to. They don't have to come through us. There are also some other agencies in the state that have this same arrangement that they could go to. But we think that we offer some some real advantages. Uh, to people. Uh, by the way, also our services are free, we should say that. Yes. <laughs> we're not, we're not charging anybody to come to us and get this help. 
Um, if people wanted more information, where can they go? Uh, you can go to our website, which is ceimain.org. You can call our main number, 882-7552, and uh, let the person who answers know that you're interested in home buyer counseling in general or rural development. We have two other counselors who can also provide this right. kind of counseling. Linda's really experienced in it. She's been doing it for a number of Great. years. Great. Well, yeah. thank you very much. I appreciate you being here. Great. Thank, thank you. you.